Taylor Ventura. And I'm Paige Lyon. And this is Skyhawk News. Hey guys, Homecoming Week starts on Monday and the theme is Total Disney. So everyone come dressed in your best impersonation of a tourist, like at Disneyland, and the whole week is going to be totally off the hook, tons and tons of fun, so it's going to be awesome. Dress up. Attention FBLA members, don't forget your service project tonight at Barnett Elementary Blech. Fall Carnival. Meet at Barnett Elementary at 4.30 p.m. The carnival ends at 8 p.m. Don't forget to wear your FBLA t-shirt. If you have not received your FBLA t-shirt, be sure to see Mrs. Raynell today before school is out. And now we will go to Clarissa with events. Oh, good afternoon Skyhawks. Clarissa here with your events. So today we have a game at Tim Few. On Monday we have girls soccer with Provo. And on Wednesday we have a Skyhawk rally. So go out there and support your fellow Skyhawks and show your school spirit, especially next week. Back to our amazing anchors. Hey guys, so there is a um, driver's ed class that starts on Monday in room E101 at 5.30 a.m. See Mr. Hernandez or Mr. McDonald with any questions about that. Get reflections entries ready. This year's theme is Believe, Dream, and Inspire. And entries are due October 15th. Go to www.shhspsta.com for guidelines and entry forms, or get one from the front office. Contact Angelina Rogers, Angela Rogers at 801-423-7723 for more information. And now we'll go to Alex um, for a special message regarding National Suicide Prevention Week. Hey guys, um, on a serious note, this week is National Suicide Prevention Week, and we just have a sor short message for you guys. Um, this is a song that was written by my band, and here's just a couple lyrics from it. We all have hard times, and it takes a toll, but we learn to smile, and the sun will show. We're here for each other, so we're never alone, and now I know, and now I've learned, and now I know. I'm not worthless, I believe. I'm not worthless, I have meaning. Hope is for everyone. You may be lost, but you'll see the sun. You will not fall. You're strong enough to carry on. You're strong enough. Um, we just want you guys to actually think about what you're doing. Notice your actions. Do not be the reason that someone thinks that they can't go on anymore. And just be nice to everybody and know that you are not worthless and that you always have hope. And back to the anchors. Don't forget that there's always somebody that will be there for you. We all go through tough times and we all go through good times, but no matter how bad things get, you always have somebody that you can turn to. That's right. And don't ever forget how much of an influence you can have over somebody else's life. Okay, um, for future writers, science fiction or fantasy fans and or the Comic Con crowd, Robison Wells, author of Riot Feedback and soon to be released Blackout is coming to our school Tuesday, September 17th in honor of his latest novel, Blackout, which takes place at the school in central Utah during the school's homecoming week. Rob is giving a presentation for HHS um, students about life as a writer and advice on navigati navigating the publishing world. 
and the presentation will be during fourth period next Tuesday in the auditorium. If you're interested in attending, please sign up in the front office. Seats are limited, and remember that you will need to make up the work you missed from fourth period if you attend. Listen up. Today, Friday, September, bleh, Friday, September 13th is the last day to get registered for UVU concurrent enrollment. Please see Mrs. Gordon in room C207 before 2.30 if, if you are having problems doing this. And now we have a video from our drill team. Guys, um, so for Powder Puff on Thursday, we're going to have a man drill team perform. They're the man shays. Woo! Um, sign up in the front office. So our first um, team practice is on Monday night from 7.15 to 8, and then there we'll decide what time works best for you guys to practice Tuesday and Wednesday, and then we dance Thursday. Um, everybody come out and participate. It's going to be a lot of fun, and shout out to my homies, Tasia Howard and Courtney Herbert. <laughs> and I think that's everything. Yep. Great, thanks guys. Okay, um, we're here with Wes Cook and Jeff Roylance, who are both winners of a pretty prestigious award. Um, we're going to ask them a little bit ab more about that. Um, so first of all, Wes, could you tell us the name of the award and, and what it means? Uh, the National Merit Scholarship um, Award. Uh, we're semi-finalists, basically. Um, it's an award for some of the nation's top students. Awesome, okay. And Jeff, can you tell us a little bit more about um, what this award means um, in your future? Um, this really could have the potential to have a large impact because the way it's entered in is by taking the PSAT, which is a test to take before the SAT, so right about on par with the ACT test on okay. level of difficulty, just based off of those scores, really. Awesome, okay. And, um, <laughs> thank you guys so much for coming on to our, our show. Also, could you tell us like how you got it, how you qualified uh, to get the award? Yeah, we just we both sat down and took the test with <laughs> the test. a bunch of other people, and uh, uh, I guess yeah. the te test went pretty well. So like, yeah. how, how many kids get in the same? Um, area? So there were right about what was Probably it, thirty? Twenty or thirty? Twenty to thirty okay. kids taking it from our mm -hmm. school. Oh, from our school. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Uh, nationally, there are one point five million. Okay. So. Wow. Awesome, you guys. Thank you so much. Um, and that's all we have on that. Also, it's Friday, and you know what that means. It's time for our school song. So everybody stand up and show your school spirit. <laughs> Let's clap and sing. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> we have to do this? <laughs> As a reminder, all of you guys, there is homecoming week starts. Don't forget to dress up as a tourist. It's going to be so fun. The whole week is going to be awesome. Student Council has worked really hard to make this amazing. So uh, I think that's all we have. Spirit, honor, heart. <laughs> Spirit, heart, heart honor, honor, success, success empower, anchored, anchored in integrity, empowered, empowered to succeed, and focused on the future. Have a great day, Skyhawks. <laughs>